So it's unlucky for me and it's unlucky for you that Blackburn Rovers are not in the Europa League. But I do have a soft spot for at least one club and that is in Group J. And we're going to take a look at him next. That's right folks, back once again with another prediction video. This time we're taking a look at the 2019-2020 Europa League, boys and girls. And we'll get to look at my early door predictions for Group J in just one second. If you're new to the channel, smash your subscribe button and keep me bang out today. With all things Blabber Rovers related, Europa League related, world football related, all things under one roof. That's right. So that's right, right, right folks, we got it all here. Under one roof. And we're going to take a look at Group J now. But before we're going to do that, we're going to obviously play a bit of Pictionary and take a little look at the logos of the teams that make up Group J. So let's get cracking. First and foremost, we have these bad boys. Now, I always, like, from a distance, that looks like a rhino. But it's actually a wolf or a something. And there's babies sucking on the boobies. From a distance, you don't see those stuff. But there it is in HD. Joining them... Uh, my boys, that's right, for the tournament, Borussia Mönchengladbach. Unfortunately, they didn't make it to the Champions League. They're going to be duking it out in the Europa League, though, in a very difficult group. Not an easy one. Uh, joining Borussia will be Wolfsburger, coming out of Austria. Mm, that's right. Duking it out and wrapping it up. It's Istanbul, Bashekir. Now, these are the recent, the recent surgeons uh, of, of, of a team coming out of Turkey, flashing the cash. Think Man City of Turkey. That's right. I'm gonna we're gonna bring them up here. Well, I'm not gonna bring them up. I'm gonna bring them up on my screen here because uh, they have uh, quite a good crop of players right now. I'm just Ada Turan uh, on loan from Barcelona. Demba Bars knocking knocking on for these bad boys. Uh, who else? Gail Clichy's in their team. Martin Skirtle's in their team. Uh, Robinho's in there. Uh, Duncan Inlers from Switzerland. So there's 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 a lot of veterans in here. Um, for uh, but they they they've they've been ripping it up. In Turkey, and they are definitely ain't no slouches. So let's get cracking and take a little look at um, the group itself. Group J. So we're going to do here each match day by match day that kind of stuff and go through it all. Uh, and then I'm going to give you the bookmakers' odds of who they think will come out on top. And this is a very tricky group. You know, too too tough to call. Um, I, I think Roma should be favourites. Mönchengladbach and uh, Başakşehir uh, and Wolfsburg will be duking it out. I think for that second spot but I'm um, obviously I've got a little bit of tinted glasses now my connection with Munchagab I was actually born uh, not far from from there it's my mum's team Munchagabag my dad's team's Hibernian out of Scotland so there's a little bit of background information for you there a bit, bit too too personal for you there folks so so you know we got a, we got a whole mix of my sister I don't know what the heck she is she's yeah I think she's the United fan I don't know she flip flops around a little bit um, so anyway one day we'll be back so anyway, Roma taking on Istanbul, match day number one, 19th of September. Early, a late kickoff here, so let's get cracking. Going to go with a 2 0 win for the Serie A bad boys uh, to get themselves up and running. Up against Istanbul, Bashiki. Now, like I said, they do have a lot of veterans in there, guys that have been there, seen it, and done it. They are a little aging, they're a little bit weary, especially as I think their way games are going to be. It's, it's, well, it's going to be hard work for them. I think when they play at home, obviously playing Turkey tight teams at home is difficult. Um, anyway, Mr. Garbag taking on Wolfsburger, and they're going to get up and running with a 3 1 win. So far, so good for my boys. 3-1. Nicely done. Match to two, though. Wolfsburg are taking on uh, Roma over in Austria. This game's going to go with a goal score in this one. Uh, five goals in it. 3-2 win, win for Roma uh, to get themselves two wins out of two. Istanbul Bashikir up against Mitchell Glabber. Going with a 2 to win for the Turkish team. They're up and running as well. So, so far, two wins uh, for Roma out of two. Uh, Istanbul and Mitchell Glabber with a win themselves. Uh, and it looks like Wolfsburg will be the whipping boys as it stands. Uh, Roma taking on Mitchell Glabber over in Italy as well. 24th of October, 2-0 victory for Roma. Make it Three wins on the spin, looking good at home as well. Clean sheets to boot. Istanbul Bashakir taking on Wolfsburger. Going to be a 2 1 win for the Turkish team as well. Back to back wins for them. Back to back home wins as well. Uh, 24th of October. Both of those games, the early kickoff. Meanwhile, Mönchengladbach taking on Roma. 7th of November. Going to be a 3 2 win for Mönchengladbach. Goals galore in this one as well. They're going to nick it just right at the death. 90th minute. Uh, they've got Breel and Bolo leading the line uh, these days. Uh, Roma, I'm not too sure. Is Zeko still with them? Uh, but they've got, uh, is it Conte the manager? I don't know. Don't don't twist me just yet. I've not got my Serie A head, head on. Uh, meanwhile, Wolfsburg will take on Istanbul over in Austria. 7th of November, this one. Going to be a 2-1 win for the Austrians. That'll get them up and running as well. That's their first points on the board. Um, and uh, they, they, it looks like they're going to be proving tough work at home, uh, giving Roma a game earlier on, but uh, unfortunately losing that game. Uh, meanwhile, 28th of November, penultimate games for 
for Istanbul, Başakir up against Roma. Going to be a 2 0 win for the Turkish teams, and they are in contention to go all out. Three wins on the spin at home uh, for them. Uh, Roma's first defeat of the campaign as well. Wolfsburger taking on Mucha Gladbach uh, over in Austria. Obviously not too much to travel for Mucha Gladbach. 20th of November as well. Same time. They're going to be a draw in this one. 2-2. Valuable away point for Mucha Gladbach. They could have succumbed to a defeat here. But uh, valuable point in the end. Uh, meanwhile, wrapping it up. Match day number six coming at you from Group J. Roma taking on Wolfsburger. 3-0 win for Roma as they look to dominate this group two defeats though for for roma back to back uh in this one it doesn't make it plain sailing for them just yet um which got taking on istanbul bashak here uh over in germany 12th of the 12th as well same time as the roma game and they will nick it two nil that's right boys and girls so that is my score predictions i'll do my four three two one in just a second get your predictions in the comment section down below what you think can happen in this group and your group you know your outlays your first your one two three fours that sort of stuff the bookmakers, though, see Roma uh, eight to thirteen on uh, to win it. Much got back nine to four to win this group. Six to one is Istanbul Başakir. Wolfsburger long shots sixteen to one. So far, so good. Wolfsburger, I've got in fourth spot with four points on the board. One win, one draw, four defeats, negative six goal difference. Bashak here will tumble out at this stage, uh, keeping uh, an unbeaten home run. Three wins out of three, uh, but losing all their away games. One uh, level uh, goal difference, seven scored, seven conceded, nine points on the board. Like I said, it's a very intimidating place to go is Turkey. Uh, doesn't matter who you are. Um, but unfortunately, he's not going to be good enough. Uh, meanwhile, Mushuk will, will nick it into second spot. Uh, Ten points on the board. Three wins, one draw, two defeats for them. And Roma will walk away with it. Twelve points on the board. Three points separate first and third. That's how close it is. Um, but an unbeaten home record for Roma without conceding a goal. Uh, Mushuk back the same. An unbeaten home record for them. Uh, a bit sloppy lead for them, though. But picking up um, a, a valuable away draw um, in Austria. So, if they lose that one, though... You never know. You never know, boys and girls. But that is my early door predictions. Uh, quick look at what the bookmakers think overall for this group. Uh, what their likelihood to win it. Roma are actually uh, joint third favourites alongside fellow Serie A side Lazio and Wolves. 16-1. to Joint fourth favourites um, to win it. Um, and check that back on the flip side. 25-1 to to win it themselves. Istanbul Bashakir, 150-1 to uh, to win it. And Wolfsburger, long, long, long shots. 500-1. to to go all out and win the Europa League this season. Again, these are early door picks. I will have match day by match day predictions on the channel a little bit later on as we get closer to the match day. Um, but uh, And they will not be live, but they'll be pre-recorded. But these suckers are live each and every time they come around. Premier League, Championship, Champions League on the channel. Mondays is your Championship venue. Premier League is on your Tuesdays. Champions League is on your Thursdays. Days uh, The times do fluctuate a little bit. But as as the days go, or as the days match days go by, you should get a vibe of when we're going to be live. That's right, vibe and live they rhyme. Uh, meanwhile, over on Twitch, I'll be doing live Black and Rose watch alongs on weekends. Catch me on on the Twitch sphere. Link to my Twitch stuff in the old description down below. Click it, head over there, follow it, so you'll know when I'm live. Um, it's mostly on Saturdays, but I'll, I'll occasionally do a gameplay, uh, some other stuff, uh, and maybe some surprise um, last minute. Um, broadcasts on twitch so you can check that out as well but just smash the follow smash the whatever it is um so you'll know when instantly when i'm live instead of me having to bug you same can apply for the youtube if you're already a subscriber smash the bell so you know when i'm live because sometimes i it's pre-planned sometimes it's spontaneous um whoa hey, hey oh and that my friends is pretty much all i've got for you today hopefully you enjoyed this video if you did smash the thumbs up it does wonders on the old youtube algorithm and again if you're new caught this by chance smash the subscribe smash the bell we're going to be covering the europa league from now well we've been doing it since the since the shitty games the the san marinos and all that kind of crap we've been there since the get-go we're going to go all the way through to the final folks um, and it's just going to get beefier and beefier. The content's going to get beefier and beefier. I might even do some simulations and all that kind of jans dingle once the uh, once the FIFA's come out and all that kind of stuff. Anyway, folks, get your predictions in. What you think will happen? Till then, thumbs up, subscribe. Chat for now. Thanks again for watching. Please like, share, and most importantly, hit the subscribe button to keep you bang up to date with all things Blackburn Rovers related, Championship related. Football related. We've got it all covered right under one roof. And while I still have you, please be sure to check out some of the old videos scattered along here. I hope.